Welcome back. I'm going to take you through the zone drop off and pick up timings for your parking stickers. As you can see, there's two stickers here on the screen. They have a one or a two. That's your group number. Group one is for primary students. Group two is for primary students who have secondary siblings, and that's the difference in the timing. So you can see the number one where the red arrows are pointing or the number two. And then you can find your zone color where the other red arrow is pointing to the color on the sticker. You would either have red, yellow, blue, or green. In this video, you can see a red and a blue car going around the lot and exiting the campus. Um, we would like the cars that are coming in that have the blue stickers to stay all the way to the right. There will be a tree in the center and, and signage, so you're going to always keep right. As you can see, the little blue cars on the screen. And red zone, when you come in, you want to be, it's two lanes of traffic, you want to stay on the inner lane all the way around until you merge across to drop off in the red zone. And you can see where the red heart is, the blue heart, the footprints, this is where the kids are going to be entering the campus. Once you pull out of the blue or red zone and you are exiting where you can see the two arrows showing the divided traffic at that point you have to make a decision whether you're going to be turning left when you leave the gate or whether you're going to be turning right because that will be barricaded off now should the campus become backed up at any point the police of Lagon uh, of the east Lagon will enforce all of our cars to go left so please follow the police directives on boundary road if you're in yellow zone and you can see the yellow heart up here at the top of the image, you that is a left turn only. And if your kids are coming, your high schoolers are coming by Uber or taxi, um, please make sure they have their money and their payments ready and they're ready to just get out of the car with their items. Same thing goes for the blue and red zone. We want the parents and not to get out of the car, parents or drivers to not get down from the car. And the students should be ready with their bags to just disembark as quickly as possible. In this picture, you can see the tree where I was referring the blue cars should stay to the right outer lane and the red cars should stay to the inner lane. And that's depicted in the top image and the bottom image. You can also see the red cars to stay to the right of this tree and the blue cars to stay to the left until you're ready to merge as you're going out the gate. There are some zone descriptions, like I mentioned, the yellow zone is for high school students only. That's in the outer frontage road. Blue zone is for families with upper primary and middle school siblings. Um, the red zone is reserved for families with early year students. That's play group up to about year two or three. And the green zone is specifically for handicap accessible parking. And these stickers, you can get them from my office. Thank you so much. And we look forward to seeing you soon.